Alright, hi guys, I'm here to update you about a lot of new arcane information coming out in June, so let's just jump right into it. So, first off, some background knowledge. There is an Annecy Film Festival, Film and Animation Festival in Europe, well more specifically France. And this is just like a normal film animation festival where like a bunch of important people just come together and show off like what they've made and future projects that are in the works. So, for Tiche obviously being a French animation company, they are showcasing a lot of arcane stuff, so more on that later. But first off, I want to clear some things up. In the last video I made about this, they showcased the arcane poster. There was a teaser on it with the Jinx rocket. And uh, there, there's some corrections to be made. They also expanded on the poster. We see now uh, a bit more obvious here. Is that, is that Jace? Man, I should have done research. I think this is Jace on the bottom. And then bottom left is Victor. Echo on the bottom left. On the top left is actually Caitlyn. I said this might have been like Savika or Camille. No, this is Caitlyn. And then the Vi. It's it's all Vi on the top right. And we also got a surprise timer dinger. So that is the updated updated poster. Links will be in the links will be in the description for all the content I've been using. So another follow up for the Annecy Festival. There was another poster similar to the first one with the Jinx rocket. This time we see Jinx on the left side. And on the right, we actually see, this is huge, okay? This is the biggest hint we've gotten towards Season 2. As of this point, was Caitlyn. Caitlyn looking real pissed with black lipstick. So either she's going through an emo girl arc, or she's on her revenge arc, and I don't think she's going goth. So, there's there's this one for the Annecy Festival. And, just yesterday, we got the new Arcane poster. The official poster for Season 2. Now, some of you guys might remember this one poster from Season 1. This was the key visual that they used. It was a picture of Powder getting hugged by Vi, and if you actually look in her hair, we see we see Jinx. The J, I, N, and X. So that's pretty interesting. So the new one, it's completely reversed. This time we have Jinx hugging Vi, and Jinx actually looks scary, okay? Um, this kind of goes to my theory where Jinx is no longer insane. Well, as psychotic as season one, and she's just she's just a cold blooded killer. And uh, yeah, this is crazy. Any implications of this? I'm I'm I, dude. Now that there's so much arcane information coming out, <laughs> it's time to put my money where my mouth is. Dude, my theories might might be wrong. I might have to delete my channel or some shit. So Jinx looks absolutely insane. Vi looks really scared. Holy frick! Look at her. Look at her. She's like, what what did I do to my sister? Was my sister? Um, I don't know if there's a V in her hair. Some people say it's like these hair strands turned upside down, turned into a V. It might be a stretch, but I mean, it's not super important, right? Anyways, yeah, Jinx hugging Vi. She's clingy. I don't see... See, th this is the problem. Uh, Jinx launched the war on Piltover because she accepts that, like, Vi and Jinx are irreconcilable after she killed Soko. And she's like... Same is Zon and Piltover. We should no longer be part of Piltover. That's why she launched the rocket. Making me curious why Jinx wants Vi. Like, she's like, Vi is mine. But we'll just have to see. Maybe it's just a poster. Maybe it's just teasing stuff. Oh well. Vi's hair also looks a lot pinker. So, maybe she dyed it or something. Who knows? Who knows? Next off. We have a post from Savika's voice actor, which shows Savika in season two. So closer, closer inspection of this picture. Savika has her hair down, and okay, this is making me feel some things. But what, what is that on her right side? Look, look, look at that. She has like spikes coming out. She has, all, she has like these advanced robes and stuff. Let's be honest. Season one, Savika was not the most impactful character. She was there. She's more secondary to Soko, and she was a secondary threat to Vi. And they're giving so much emphasis to Savika, especially at the end of season one with her in Soko's room. I think she's gonna become leader. So maybe that theory is correct. Whatever, I'll jack myself off because of that. But yeah, Savika looks fucking crazy here. Oh my god, I really wonder what the spikes are. Maybe she upgraded her arm another time. Is this the right arm? No, it's it's it, that's her right arm. All right, whatever. And here's an interview from voice actor behind Jinx, Ella. Oh, oh, I am. In the words of Graham, a human spoil machine. Yeah. So I'm. So, I, what can I say? <laughs> I can say it's really good. Okay. I actually just went and did ADR for the last episode, and I cried. It's so amazing, and what they've done. I mean, the, it looks so good, and yeah. I'm really excited for people to see what they've come up with. It's worth the wait. I promise. I'll yeah. say that much. Yeah. <laughs> 
So this is what I'm really scared about, right? Um, I see a lot of discussion how, oh, RK might not be as good as season 1, there's gonna be a sophomore slump where the second season of anything is normally not as good as the first one, and everyone just accepts that Arcane is, is just, like, season 2 is not gonna live up to expectations. I'm really excited. This is confirmation that we get that it's gonna be good. Obviously not sure if our confirmation, but, like, we all have a lot of trust in Fortiche, and we all want Arcane to do well, and there's so much stuff set up, it, it seems really hard to piece everything together, and... Hopefully, it seems like they've the, the writing crew done it, so that's going to be absolutely amazing. Season 2 is going to be peak, and my channel is going to blow up, right guys? Yeah. And finally, uh, the NSC Awards. Um, they said there's going to be a Forti Studio event at June, June 11th, and there's going to be a specific Forti Riot event about Arcane in June 12th. And I actually want to say some stuff. Um, so one, they're, they're going to show Making of Arcane. I wonder how similar that is going to be to Bridging the Rift. And there's gonna, maybe there's going to be more sneak peeks. There should be new information dropped. I'm pretty sure if you look on YouTube... Hold on, give me... Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. June 12th. June 12th. This sneak peek of Arcane came out. And you know what else is happening on June 12th? This event. So I'm not saying there's gonna be a teaser or anything. This is gonna be the first Malfone theory to actually be confirmed or not. There's gonna be a sneak peek on June 12th. So, that's gonna be an update to Arcane. Hope you guys enjoyed my update. I will keep on doing this so long as information is coming out. So, yeah, I mean, that, that's pretty much all for me, guys. And if you guys are excited, let me know your thoughts. And I'll catch you guys in the next one. How about that?